Hey guys, let's chat about Cincy Club. We had our call, our weekly call on Tuesdays. We had it just this past Tuesday and I shared a few things about Cincy Club. But I, for those of you who may have missed the training, I want to share some things with you guys about Cincy Club. Yes, so I am a clubber, first of all, and I love being a clubber because there are all sorts of perks for being a clubber, even for consultants. And it's a great idea for consultants to be a clubber if you're looking to get other people to be a part of the Cincy Club. Okay, first of all, let's say this. There is no cost to join the Cincy Club. There is no membership or anything like that. People do not have to pay to become a part of the Cincy Club. They can opt in and out whenever they like. So they're not confined to this. So make it be known that it's easy in and it's easy out. And they can make adjustments to the Cincy Club. That is like so fun. Now, the purpose of this Cincy Club originally was to always get your bar, always get my bar. That was the main purpose of this so that for those of us, like Beach is my favorite scent, but Beach is not available anymore, but I still have Beach in my club. And it's going to be in my life forever and ever because that's the scent that inspired me to become a consultant. That's the first scent I ever wore. So, of course, it's in my club. So, that was the main purpose. But since then, all the consumable products are in our club. So, anything that people run out of can go in the club. So, I know a lot of you guys are new that may be watching here. But as simple as creating a sub subscription and you choose your products, it's easy when you, once you go in and you choose it and you choose your shipping schedule, then you take advantage of the, the perks. Now, another perk that you can receive being a part of the Cincy Club is the brick. You unlock a brick. A brick is not available on our PWS. The only way to get a brick is to be a part of the Cincy Club. Now, something else to know about Cincy Club. Okay, it says here, uh, referral program, Cincy Club referral rewards and referral program. When you shop Cincy Club for yourself or refer friends and family who then order from Cincy Club, you'll earn points. You can use towards the future orders in club or anywhere on your consultant's personal website, including warmers, diffusers, Cincy buddies, and more. You earn points in two ways, two ways. You earn you earn one point for every dollar you spend in Cincy Club. For example, you earn 25 points and you get a dollar off. Or uh, you earn 500 points and you get $20 off. You earn 1,000 points and you get $40 off and so on. So earn two points for every dollar you're, that anytime you do a referral, if you refer somebody, you actually earn two points. So I want to cover that part. Now... Okay, and I think I... Okay, here's some other perks that I didn't mention. Always get my bar is the first thing. You get an additional half off whenever uh, you spend $60, okay? Now, you get 10% off at... I skipped this part. <laughs> when you spend $30, you get 10% off the order. And when you spend $60, you, you get an, an additional... You get a half off. And you earn points towards the discounts through the Cincy Club. We talk about the referral program. You customize your, your scheduling, all that. Okay, we talked about that. So, okay. Now, here's some of the things that you can add to the Cincy Club. Just in case you guys didn't notice, I'm going to tell you. Your bars, your, your whip box, your laundry products, your light bulbs, scent circles, car bars. Um, what is it? The um, cotton cleanups can be added there. Uh, anything that oils for the diffusers. The, um, what is, what do you call it? the filters for the, uh, air purifier? Anything that you'll need to replace. Counter clean, bathroom cleaners, personal care products. All of this can go in the club because you run out of this stuff and you're going to need more. So always remember that. You can't get warmers. You can't get diffusers. You can't get warmers. You can't get those. Those are not consumable. Just remember consumables. All right. So from time to time, since he has these incentives, uh, the last incentive that since he had where we had to get three new clubbers to earn something fabulous. So 
This right here from the summer incentive, I have it sitting right here before me. This huge blanket, okay? This is ginormous. I got this from the last Cincy Club incentive. And I have to give a, a shout out to Shelly because on the very last day almost, I did. I almost didn't earn it because I had so much going on. I didn't even focus on it. You get what you focus on. I didn't even focus on it. And she messaged me and said, how close are you to earning um, the uh, that level? I said, I'm not even close. I got zero clubbers right now. I'm talking about new clubbers. I got clubbers, but I just zero new clubbers. She said, well, I have hit all three. I said, okay, I guess I need to get to move it. I need to go out here and ask some people. So she told me what she did and I did that and I earned it in like probably less than 30 minutes. So I got this blanket because of that, okay? She told me what she did and I did that. So what I did that time, I, I have a VIP group on Facebook and in the VIP group, you have an option to use the community chat. So I used the community chat and I did like an incentive for my customers. I said, who's interested in, in getting um, some some discounts or free stuff? Something like that is what I said. I gave away, uh, that's a personal special and I was able to do that privately. So um, I did that and I got my three clubbers in no time. I just, I can't remember. I, I had something sitting around the house that I just gave them because they, they signed up for it. So yeah, just like that. So this time, let me tell you what I did this time. This time I did something different. I did not, and again, I have to give a shout out to Shelly again because Shelly put it in a chat that we're in. She was talking about how she got a new clubber and I said, okay, I got to get on it again because I didn't even realize that we had another incentive with clubbing because I've been so busy working all of these events and doing fundraising like it's so busy. So, um, I decided, let me try something different. And let me tell you what I did this time, guys. My approach last time was like, I, it was like hit or miss. I wasn't sure if I was going to get it, but I did get it. So it's amazing the power of asking. The power, there is power between behind asking. You never know what you're going to get when you ask somebody a question, guys. You might get no, but you might just get a yes. But there is power in asking. So I, when I put it out there last time, sure enough, I got it. But this time I did it differently. And I'm going to tell you why. So by the show of hands, guys, how many of you guys use washer whips? How many of you use washer whips? Or how many of you guys even know what a washer whip is? Do you know what a washer whip is? Okay. A washer whip, our washer whips are like fragrance boosters. You add them to your wash cycle and they are HE safe. You place it in the washing machine to add fragrance to your laundry. That's what washer whips are. So at my events and wherever I am, I always brag about our washer whips. It, I mean, I have a lot of customers who buy washer whips because I talk about it and I'm prepared to hand out something so they could try it. So lately what I've been doing in addition to passing out the samples of the washer whips, I take a washcloth with me to my events. I wash my washcloth in the washer whip, and then I take it and place it inside of a bag with more washer whips each day. So I just pull the towel out and I have people to smell it. And when they smell it, they want to buy it, right? So... This is the tub right here. This tub is $30. So this is the one that I promote. Now, people do start out with the jar. The, the small size is $12. People generally start with that one, but they fall in love with it. When they call me back, I tell them about getting a bang for the buck. Let's get a bang for the buck. Let's go ahead and get you the tub. Most of my customers, guys, who love the washer with, they don't, they don't, they don't just buy one. They buy three to six of these tubs. They love it that much. It's a full addiction. So they buy a lot of them. And this particular scent is clothesline. So this is the scent that I market. I market it because it's fresh. It just, I mean, I also, I mean, 
in the samples that I pass out. I use this one in the samples. Another one that I market is Jammy Time. Jammy Time has lavender in it. So I market that one. I don't have samples for it, but I let people smell it. So I have the jars where, you know, with the jars, you can twist it so people can smell it. So these are in plastic, so you can't, I mean, you can open it, but I don't. I just have the jars. Now, um, and the other one that I've been taking with me is Fiji Flower. Fiji Flower is one that my daughter loves. I love to talk about what she loves. People buy what she likes, okay? And most people who get that one, my daughter's 23. People usually buy that in their 20s. And it's funny how you learn what people like based on their age. I, I, I've i been working around people for so long. I can tell what they want based on their age. So I have guided my customers over the years to fall in love with washer wheels. Now, let me tell you something new that I'm going to start doing. I have project broadcasts. And in Project Broadcast, it allows you to create tags. And if you guys are using, you know what I'm talking about. When you create tags, that means you categorize your customers. So I'm starting to categorize my customers for all the places that I meet them at my events. And the next thing I want to start, I haven't done it yet. I'm going to start a new category with washer wheels. I also have, you can do more than one category for one customer. So when my customers buy a diffuser, I will tag them for the location where I met them, and I also tag them for a diffuser, or I tag them for air purifier in the location, or I'll tag them for, uh, what else did I, uh, yeah, diffuser and air purifier. So now I'm gonna tag them for the washer wheels. And the reason why, because I find that my customers who order washer wheels, they get more refills more frequently than the bars. Yes, my customers who buy the washer wheels call me more frequently than the people with the bars. Now, it's up to us to introduce it to people because otherwise they don't know. This is different. You're going to have to introduce it to people. How you do that? Well, in my laundry room, I have a whole lot of this. I take pictures of what I have personally. I go live and talk about how I'm doing my laundry. And when I'm face to face with people, I always like for them to smell my jacket because I love to wash my jacket in it. And I tell them, you know what? This fragrance is so bold until my scent linger for a few days. And that is true. Because when I wash my jacket, I'm able to smell it several days later. And the same thing when, you, when you're washing your towels and your linen and you pack that stuff back. Sometimes when you leave things packed for a while, it loses whatever freshness. But when you pack your towels away after you use the washer wheels, it's still going to have that fresh fragrance. And this is the feedback that I've been getting from my customers. They tell me, oh my goodness, that stuff is everything. I've actually had people to want to put a little bit in a bag and leave it in the car because they love it so well. I've actually had people to join my team because they love this so well. So let me tell you how I approach these last three who I got signed up for the club. These last three uh, that I got, I call them because they're on my list because they buy so much. One of them, he ordered four tubs and four dryer discs. And the other one, she usually ordered one at a time, but she's frequently ordering it. Then my other customer ordered two of these at a time. So I picked up the phone and called them. I called them and told them about the Cincy Club. I told them about the perks. And I wrote it down. I wrote down how much they were going to save and told them how much. And I took it and sent that to them. Like, you're going to save this if you do this. So really, as and I told them, look, I, I just... I'm, I'm in a contest right now. I told them that. <laughs> I said, that won't that bag. Can you help me? There's nothing wrong with asking people to help you. But you know what? Ultimately, what happened, even though I said that, they came out ahead. And all I can think about is all the time that I miss talking to them about club. I'm like, man, they could have been saving money. And I could have, like one of my customers, 
He doesn't live that close to me. He lives about 45 minutes to an hour from me. Now he can get his automatically at his front door. And I was trying to figure out like what kind I was stressing out about when I was going to be able to meet him to get those washer whips. No more stress, guys. Oh, my goodness. And I tell you, even though there's shipping involved, this particular guy, he saved $26 on his club. The one who bought four uh, washer whips and four dryer discs, he saved $26. Let me tell you why. He got 10% off of his order off the top. Then I put one of the washer whips in so he could save $15 because he got a half price. And then his shipping was $8. He came out ahead, guys. He did. He came out here. He was so grateful. And then he asked me this question. Do you have enough clubbers? Are you going to be able to get that back? <laughs> it's amazing how your customers don't mind helping you. So... I went ahead and went to my next customer. And I tell you, she said this. She said, this is a no-brainer. She said, how often do I get those washing whips? I said, about every two months. She said, okay, sign me up. Sign, go ahead and sign me up. I signed her up. We did the math. Sometimes you got to do the math for them. Pull your calculator out and tell them based on the percentage that they're saved. Okay, you're going to save 10% over here. Then you're going to get the half off. Then you're going to get referral points. Break it down to them. I picked the phone up and called them. You're buying this anyway. And you're buying it frequently. Let's go ahead and get you on the club. So, yeah, I've earned the incentive just like that. It within less than 30 minutes. Because I have introduced to them something that I know they're going to do. I know they're going to wash clothes. This is the one thing you know people are going to do, right? That waxing warmers, everybody might not use that. But we know everybody's washing the clothes. So this is a win, guys. But the only way you're going to be successful with getting people to join, I mean, join the Cincy Club, is for you to use it. You personally need to use it. If you're not using it, you can't tell them about how great this is. If you don't have a Sensi Club, you cannot tell them how made. If you're not using these things, guys, it, it's going to be hard for you. So you have to use these in order for people to relate to what you're saying. I give these testimonies all the time. I even tell people that when somebody come to my house, they ask me, what are you warming outside? I smell something outside. No, that's my laundry coming through the vents. So, guys, you got to give your personal experience because people, they're not going to want to hear you say something about something that you haven't used. If you guys are new and you haven't experienced this yet, I want you to next time you place an order, add this to your order. Add it to your, add it as host reward so you can get it for free or half off. But I encourage you guys, the next time, you place an order the next time make sure that you get yourself some washer whips and if you're not if you're not if you're real familiar with it just yet the fragrances this is a good one clothesline is a good one because it's fresh people relate to fresh more than anything so i want you guys to go out there and find some people to talk to about Sensi club because it is really an amazing program i have three clubs you can only have three. <laughs> I got one that come every month, every two months, and every three months. So you can choose the frequency. They can cancel when they want to. They can make necessary changes. But remember, with the always get my bar, if you change something with that, you can lose that bar. That's the only thing about that one that you can't change. But I just wanted to share this with you guys because it is so easy to get some clubbers, guys. So make sure you introduce the washer whips to them because this is what's going to get you clubbers. Okay? Okay, guys, have a great night. Love you. Bye.